What's going on guys? Welcome back to Touchdowns to Home Runs. My name's Bernie and today we're going to be breaking down the NBA's new plan to bring games back in July. But before we get into that, my partner Noah and I would like to thank you guys so much for getting us to 1,000 subscribers. And we are planning on doing a giveaway very soon. So if you aren't already, make sure you hit that subscribe button to not miss a video and enjoy the video. Earlier this morning, Woj and Adam Schefter both tweeted out that the NBA was planning to send 22 teams back into action on July 31st, where they will be playing at Disney World in Orlando. The 22 teams consists of the 16 playoff teams that were in that current position pre-COVID, as well as the six teams within six games of the playoffs when the NBA stopped. These teams that aren't in the playoffs that still got invited are the Trailblazers, Pelicans, Kings, Suns, Spurs, and Wizards. These teams are going to be playing eight games to end the season and figure out the seeding, who's in, who's out as well as a possible 8-9 play-in game. So the only real complicated part of this process comes with that 8-9 play-in game. The top eight teams are supposed to make it from each conference as if it was a normal season. However, if the nine seed is within four games of the eight seed when the eight games comes to an end, then they're gonna be playing a best of three or double elimination game as a play-in for that eight seed into the playoffs. In my opinion, I'm just really happy that the NBA is returning and we're going to start to see sports within the next month and a month and a half. Honestly, I think it's been too long and I'm just really excited. I think the process though is a little bit messed up. I like it for the most part, but I don't like that 8-9 thing. I think that whoever is the 8 seed at the end of the 8 games is the one that should be in the playoffs. But I'm not complaining. And if you guys made it to this point in the video, I want to hear your thoughts down below. Are you excited? Do you like the process? And if you haven't already, make sure to hit that subscribe button because I can tell you, you do not want to miss this giveaway. So make sure you stick around. As always, guys, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys next time.